Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Raquel. I thought it would be a really fun video for me to film what I feed my kids in a day. I have a 10 year old and a one and a half year old and I just want to show you that even though they have a huge age gap, I can still fix very similar meal plans and they love it just the same. I love to eat myself. So I wanted to share my love of eating with my kids by cooking them home cooked meals as often as possible. I try to switch it up as well. So we don't eat the same thing over and over again, but I do incorporate the same ingredients often. So if you guys would like to see this video, go ahead and stick around. But the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to saute some of this maple sausage for Ava. I think I'm gonna just do half of one for Ava and two for Javion. So I'm gonna throw this on a pan right now. This is our boss, baby. Nana. You want a Nana? So Ava's already up asking for a Nana. Which these are huge, so she's probably not gonna eat it all. <laughs> so this is part of her breakfast. Yay. Eat your banana. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> she had to take off Okay, so if you hear noise in the background, that's just the kids and that's Peppa Pig on the TV. I turned that on so Ava can be a little bit more distracted while I film. So now I'm going to make parfaits, which is one of Javion's favorites and Ava Noel no. likes it as well. So for this, all I'm gonna do is grab some strawberry yogurt, some strawberries, or you can use any fruit that you would like. I also have blackberries, so I could use that as well, but I'm gonna go with the strawberry theme for this parfait. And I have these Quaker yogurt chewy bars. So um, I don't know how to make chewy bars from scratch. If you guys have a really good recipe, let me know in the comments below, but I'm going to split this between the two of them. Actually, I'll probably make myself a small bowl and split this between the three of us. So um, this is the parfait bowl that I'm about to make. Okay, so this is what my kids are eating for breakfast. This is Jay's plate. 
So this is the avocado toast and I put a sprinkle of the lemon pepper on it and then he has two of the maple sausages and then I gave him a nice hefty portion of the parfait um, and then for Ava Noel I just gave her one of the maple sausages and um, some avocado. She doesn't like it smashed up onto anything. She won't eat it that way. So I just got her, I just left it sliced just like this and she loves avocado. I didn't put any seasoning or anything with it. This is just all I'm going to add to it. Ooh, you know what? I forgot to put something on that toast. I just remembered that I made some pico yesterday, pico de gallo. So I'm just gonna add some of that to Javion's toast. Mm -hmm. So, and again, I'm not gonna add any of that to Ava Noel's just because her taste buds are extremely sensitive because she's younger. So that's gonna be too much and we like a lot of onion in our pico. So this is now what Javion's plate looks like. It looks so good. And this is it right here. Here's his parfait and his meal. And Ava, she's notorious for wearing her food. She is a um, food artist. Um, she will have this everywhere, so I might cut this in half when I give it to her and then just gradually give her more food as the time goes by. You excited to eat? Mm, yes. The sausage. Go try the sausage. Mmm, good. Really so good. sweet. Okay. Mm, it's good. There is your parfait, sir. There you go. And you see she still has her banana that she hasn't finished. And there is the other portion. She probably took a couple bites and that's another reason why I didn't give her... Oh, she's putting the rest of it over there. And that's why I didn't give her the rest of... Um, that's why I didn't give her any bread. Because she had enough carbs. Mmm. Did you pray, Ava? Pray. Jesus. Thank you for this food, in Jesus' name, amen. amen. Yay, Jesus. <laughs> and here's this. Uh, we'll put that right there. She put the either all on. Wrong way, There we go. It's actually doing really good. She hasn't gotten it all over herself. So this is the first time we put the pico on the avocado toast. Do you like it? Mm-hmm. Okay, I gotta make this quick because my battery's dying, but Javion of course cleared his plate so he loved everything and he says he's full right now, so we're good to go with that. This is Ava Noel's plate. Um, she actually got a hold of the bananas and started smashing them and then she got a hold of her parfait and started pouring it all over herself. Looks like she ate all the strawberries, maybe give her more strawberries next time. Um, she didn't eat all her avocado, but she did eat all of her meat, which was very surprising. So she must've liked that really a lot. So that was really good to see. So that's what we had today for breakfast. We will see you during lunch. Okay, so it's lunchtime now and I'm going to make Ava Noel a quesadilla and I'm going to make Javion a salad. So um, for the quesadilla, I have these corn tortillas. So it'll probably be better to have the flour tortillas just because the corn tortillas are very flimsy and they can sometimes break off, but we like these the best to make like tacos. So this is what I have on hand and of course you need cheese. And I'm gonna put chicken in her quesadilla. Not all of this chicken, of course. This is also for the salads that I'm going to make. I made tacos yesterday. So I'm just gonna shred up some of this chicken and put that in her quesadilla. And I have some spinach. So I'm gonna wilt this into the quesadilla. So let's get to making it.
Okay, so next I'm just about to assemble JV on a salad. Um, he's not lactose intolerant, but sometimes a lot of cheese, especially for whatever reason, melted cheese really hurts his stomach. So um, he didn't want a quesadilla. Um, I asked him he wanted a salad instead, which is awesome. So I'm going to give him this half and half mix. This is half spring mix and half baby spinach. Usually I only get baby spinach because I like to put them in different things. But today I decided to switch it up and add a little bit of spring mix as well. So I'm going to assemble that. And I just wanted to show you guys these cool little bento boxes. I, I guess that's what they're called. I'm not really sure. They don't have the like compartments, so maybe they're not bento boxes. But anyways, I got these, um, I believe they were 10 or 15 pack. I can't remember, but I got them from Walmart. And I'll leave a link below. And I really love to put um, salads in this thing because it's nice and big. Look how big it is. It's long, it's big. You can get a nice healthy salad in there. And then they have a cap or they have a lid also with it. So you can just shake it up when you put your dressing in there and then you get all of the salad covered in this thing. So I really, really like it. And it's like BPA, microwavable safe. Um, you can put them in the freezer so these things are awesome so really like them so yep i'm about to assemble his salad so i just rinsed the lettuce out i'm gonna add some chicken to it Okay, so this is what we're working with. This is Javion's salad. You guys saw everything that I put into it. I forgot to buy some shredded carrots. Usually I put that in here as well just to hide some more nutrients in here. You can't even taste them and you're getting that vitamin A. And I gave him a medley of berries as well. So this is a nice heaping salad. This should keep him full until dinner time. So that's why I like to give him this big heaping salad as I did. And this is for Miss Ava Noel. I'll probably give her some hummus on the side because she likes to dip things. So this is her plate. These are her quesadillas and her berries. So to give these to the babies. Actually gonna give her a couple crackers. Also, oh, wow. yeah, and I took her shirt off. Usually she doesn't eat with the shirt on because I know she will make a mess like she did for breakfast. Okay, so this is Ava Noel's plate. As you see, she really wasn't all that hungry. So I'm just gonna offer this to her a little bit later as a snack. So here is Javion's completed lunch. So of course he ate all of his berries, you see that. And here is the damage done. He actually asked for more lettuce. So I gave him another fistful of lettuce with this. No toppings, nothing extra, just lettuce. So he ate up all the lettuce that you guys saw before and then this is just the remaining part. So he said this was the best salad that he's ever had and he enjoyed it so much. So I'm very happy that he liked his salad and that he asked for more lettuce. And I will see you guys during dinner. All right, now we have dinner. So I'm just making some chicken thighs. And to this, I'm just gonna add 
Marcus should be coming home soon. I'm going to add some olive oil, drizzle that on each one of those. Okay, kind of, kind of work it in. Ugh, I hate this feeling. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna wash my hands. Okay, so next it's seasoning, and I always start off with the no salt first, and then I end with the salt, so you guys will kind of see what I mean. So first I'm gonna start with pepper. All right, and then I add a bit of the lemon pepper. So I'm even gonna close the spout. And lastly, I'm gonna add some paprika. All right, so here is what the chicken looks like. My oven is set to 425. I'm gonna put it in for about 30 minutes. I'll probably put it in a little bit longer just to get that crispy skin on the top but I'll start off with putting it in for 30 minutes and I'm gonna make the sides now all right here is dinner so starting with the chicken this is how the chicken turned out it looks mighty delicious oh and the juices are running over and this is broccoli so I buy the frozen broccoli and then I boil it and as soon as the water starts boiling, I turn it off and I season it with garlic powder. And then I put some cheese, just a little bit of cheese, and then I put the lid on it. So there is steamed broccoli. And then this is just a red potato on it. I season it with a little bit of Cajun salt, um, cheese, and I can't believe it's not butter. So that's Jay's plate. And then Ava Noel's plate. She just has some shredded chicken and on the side I put a bit of ketchup because she likes dipping things so she can dip her chicken in the ketchup. And I also have some broccoli and cheese. And I also have a potato for her. This is a huge potato so um, we'll probably share it. So this is dinner. Food that you gave us to the end. In his name, I pray. That was such a good prayer. You enjoy. Oh, that's, that's the good part. She loves cheese. Mmm. Let's see how JV is doing. Ate all your broccoli. Very good. I love broccoli and cheese. Broccoli and cheese, me too, so good. Okay, you guys, so this is the result of dinner. As you can see, Javion ate all of his broccoli, which is a great thing. Um, pretty much did a really good job on his chicken and his potato, so I think he did really well on this. And this <laughs> is Ava Noel's tray, as you can see. As you can see, she began to play with her food. Um, but while she was eating it, she was really, really into the potatoes. So I'm gonna make more of that for her. Um, she really didn't touch her broccoli too much. I think it's just spread all over the plate. So what I'm gonna do next is kind of like chop it down. And then I'm gonna mix it in with her potato. So she's, I'm gonna hide the broccoli in there next time. And then um, she ate a bit, there's some chicken on here still, so she really didn't eat much of her chicken either. So but if she gets a little bit hungry later on, I can make her maybe another potato or something that she can't eat. 
that is all that I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.